Want to keep up with the latest Komodo gaming videos? Be sure to subscribe and click that bell. It's going to look like it's a little bit better angle this time. Oh, there we go. Oh, he tipped the light pole. Hold on, land it, land it, land it, land it, land it. Uh-oh. Oh. <laughs> Hello, YouTube. Komodo Gaming here. Bring you guys another episode of Beam and G Drive. And yes, folks, we are back once again. And today we are back with a brand new mod. Now, this is called the LKS Pre-Runner. This is an off-road truck, and it is absolutely amazing. It's got several different variations. I think there's like six of these things. And yeah, this is probably one of the most epic mods here in BeamNG Drive. So yeah, I was watching the YouTubes uh, yesterday, and I saw that Neological got a hold of these, and I thought, oh, geez, I have to cover these. I have to play with them. I have to do chases. I want to do jumps. I just overall want to have a blast with these because that's one thing I felt that uh, Beam and G kind of lacked was a really, really awesome trophy truck, and now we have it here. Now, we'll go through the variations real quick, and then we'll get to uh, driving around, test it out, probably do some chases, probably do several different maps and jumps, and just try to get a hold of these beasts. So anyways, we're going to be doing that here today. If you guys have any suggestions for future Beam and G episodes, comment below. And if you're enjoying this game on the channel, maybe hit that thumbs up button. It helps out my channel, and let's do this. All right, so there's eight different versions of this. I think it's really six versions. A couple of them just have different paint jobs. So you got the strip down, which looks like it's missing all the body panels. You got the all-terrain, which there's two different versions of that. I think it's just paint jobs. And it actually looks like the bumper on the front is different, so maybe a little bit different weight. You've got the West Coast USA, which I think is made for tarmac, city streets. Uh, you've got the Endurodrome, which I believe this is just a beast at jumping, so we'll probably take that over to the car jump arena or something. Uh, you've got the Baja Rama, which I think that's perfect for like a Baja 1000 truck. Same with the Desert Trails. I guess those might be kind of similar to the Baja one. Uh, there probably is a little bit of a difference here. But yeah, this is uh, absolutely amazing. And when I saw Neil play with these, I was like, oh boy. Here it goes, which by the way, if you haven't checked out Neil, you might want to check out that channel if you're just all about Beam and G because he puts out some pretty awesome mod videos. So anyways, I'm going to put a couple of these away. I just wanted to have them out for the intro. I'm going to pick, I think we're going to do the uh, the white and red one over there and test this thing out. And maybe we'll stick one more out here with me and see how the AI reacts to these. Uh, I think we're about ready to go. Look how much power this thing has. It's stupid ridiculous. Like, oh, it's awesome though. Now, I think the AI is going to have a bit of issue with driving these. I could be wrong. Hold on. Let's go ahead and get over there to him. Oh, that is awesome. All right. Hello, Mr. AI. I'm going to go ahead and get you to... Let's get a little in front of you. Let's go ahead and just get you to try to chase me. What is going to happen? Can you... Uh... Oh, nope. Nope. The AI is... Uh... Oh, they're trying. No, no. I don't think this is going to happen. On, oh, on, oh, there he goes. <laughs> just too much power. You can hear him just spinning their tires. Uh, they can't figure out how to get the gas all the way down. All right, so this one's not really meant for tarmac, but we're gonna try it on it anyways. We'll go find like an off-road trail to hit, and then we'll probably try. Oh, that was stupid. <laughs> well, there goes the tire. All right, uh, we can easily fix that. We have another two tires on the back of it. Oh, let's just go. Boop. There we go. Uh, good to go. Oh, I love the power of this thing. All right, let's go see. You know, we don't even need a trail. This is an off-road vehicle. It's a truck. Let's just go off-roading right now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. All right. Let's uh, let's get down this little cliff area first, real quick. There we go. All right. Avoid the rocks. Probably still can blow out a tire on those. All right, here's a trail up here. All right, so give it some gas. Let's go ahead and get over here to the right. And we've flipped it. Come on, flip back over. Come on. No, that's a tree. Uh-oh. Yep, and we're stuck. That's great. All right, we're trying the off-roading portion again. We're just going to try to hold it wide open throughout here. Uh, or somewhat wide open. This thing is still a bit too much of a beast to just go completely wide open. There we go. Ah, this feels pretty good. You know, I'm pretty sure we're going to see some rally scenarios with this really soon. And that could be really awesome. Oh, yeah, this is fun. So, yeah, you got this version. Uh, we're going to try out some of the other ones. I do want to try out the West Coast USA one. Uh, that could be pretty cool, bombing some of those hills in there. And then I think we will switch over to the red one, which is apparently set up for jumps. We'll see how much air we can get. But right now, we're just kind of doing a little bit of off-roading. 
Yeah, I bet you I could set up a couple cop cars and have a decent chase with this, even though I do think we will be faster, because once this thing finally hooks up, it's gone. Like, it is completely gone. So if you're wondering about interior on this, it's actually really cool. You can see where the driver is and where the co-pilot would be. So I'm picturing something like Baja 1000, uh, stuff like that. So that's uh, pretty awesome. All right, looks like we got an uphill section we can hit. Man, I really wish you could spawn in more of these. Uh, maybe we can go to one of the other maps that's got a more dedicated racetrack and possibly the AI can get around it. I don't know, they might be able to. Oh, this is pretty bad up here. I do not want to fly off this road. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, keep it wide open. No, 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 I overcorrected. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Han, no, no, we got this. Just get down to the other road. Oh, oh, I love how tough the suspension is. That's awesome. Wow, if that would have been any other car, we would have already busted the suspension, blown out some tires. Ah, that is so cool. I could drive this thing all day. I actually really kind of want to try it out with the wheel. I pictured it would be uh, kind of satisfying. I watched a couple people play BMG with the wheel. Uh, maybe that would be a thing. All right, so the question is, what is the crash model like on this? Is it still really, really nice? Oh, there we go. Oh. <laughs> All right, well, you know, that's got a pretty flexible body on it. I don't know what they make the body out of, but it still does bend up. Uh, completely ripped off a piece of the... Actually, the whole wheel's gone. Looks like the suspension's broken. Yeah, it's still uh, the same old Beam and G damage model. Pretty nice. Uh, roll cage held up quite well, too. So, all right, I got a couple other plans with this. Let's try a quick police chase. All right, so we switched over to the West Coast version of this uh, since it should be better on tarmac. And I think that's where the police car is going to be most comfortable. So I gave him a couple sporty police cars. Let's go ahead and go AI and chase me. All right, let's get moving here. Ooh, I can hear him. Oh, they're right on my rear. Oh, 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 watch out, watch out. <laughs> I probably should have started them on the straight road here. Should have. Uh, let's see if we can. Oh, I can't get it to hook up. Come on, come on. There we go. Uh, back wheels are still spinning. And, nope, still going, still going. And throttle. I think they are, uh, you know, let's reset them real quick. Let's see if we can get them to get out of that parking lot. Yeah, they overshot that corner. Oh, man, they tore those things up. Wow. All right, there we go. Uh, what are they doing? Okay, they are not aware of the road, are they? Let's set them out a little closer. All right, got them set back up. Let's go AI chase me. All right, we need a lot of the tires here. Ooh, this bridge is going to be a little bit of an issue. All right, so let's get up over this. Up, 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 up. What's up with some of the textures here in Utah? Something, uh... Uh-oh, something's a little screwed up. On, oh, oh, no! No! Oh, are they still coming? No, this thing will go with uh, three tires. It's fine. Uh, I think they've already eaten it already again. Yeah, there goes somebody's tire over to the side. Oh, and there's one cop car down. Where's the other one at? All right, I think this thing might be a little too fast for them. Uh, let's see if we can get around to the other side. All right, so this might just be strictly a rally-style car. Yeah, here comes the other... Oh. What the heck happened to you here? You had a straightaway, dingus. All right, so can confirm uh, police chases with this. This might be a little too fast for them. Uh, might not be competitive. Maybe a little bit of police escape, if I were to spread them out, uh, would probably work. So we might try that in the future. But I still want to go over the other versions of this car. All right, so we're going to test out the Endurodrome version of this uh, vehicle. This one's made for stunts and stuff, so... Oh, boy. All right, so we're going to go ahead and try this in the car jump arena. Let's go ahead and send it off here. Uh-oh, uh-oh, here we go. All right. Oh, boy. How far is this truck going to launch? Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh, about 160. Ooh, there it goes. We need to actually find a, a ramp ramp for this thing to go up. Oh, is it going to land? Oh! Oh! Oh, I think it's okay. Oh, no, nope, never mind. You know, I actually think it's possible to land here. And that's not something you say very often in the car jump arena. Like, the suspension didn't break. It compressed all the way, and I lost control on the bottom. But this might be the perfect vehicle to hit some really big jumps and actually have a chance to land it in Beam and G. Okay, here we go. Try to stay attached to it. There we go. That was not very good. Let's see. Let's go ahead and get that speed up. And 
I'm waiting for the release. There it goes. Okay, come on, land, land, land. Uh... Oh, there it goes. No, oh, we lost a tire that time. But look at that. It is, uh, for the most part, besides blowing the tire out there, that was pretty good. That's actually really cool. All right, give it another go. All right, here we go. Roll off this. Try to keep it straight. Okay, if I can get the back end to come up a little bit, that would be ideal. So I'm going to hold on the throttle once we release the ramp. I think that might have a little bit of an effect on it. There we go. There's back ends up a little bit. Ah, it's tilting. Come on. Ugh. Oh, how come I'm losing tires now? I wasn't losing them before. Oh. <laughs> oh, that was cool looking. That was awesome. Wow. You know, I kind of want to experience that from the first person. All right, folks, we're ready to release. Let's go down. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. <laughs> okay. Question is, are we going to survive? Will we make it through to the other side here? Here we go. And big release. We're flying. Can't see our landing. Waiting for it. Oh, oh, oh. This is going to hurt. Oh, there it goes. <gasps> Wait. Hold on. Lock it down. Lock it down. No, no, no. Don't flip. Don't flip. Don't flip. Don't flip. Don't flip. No, it flipped and caught at the last moment. Look, we landed with all four tires. I'm going to count that as a landing. Hold on. Hold on. No. Yeah, we uh we kept all four on it that time. It actually went sideways, like dead sideways there, and I kind of overcorrected it. Yeah, that's, it caught in the sand trap. Like, if that would have been asphalt the rest of the way, I think we actually could have landed that. That is too cool. All right, let's go run some more tests. I'm having a lot of fun right now. All right, so it seems like this Baja Arama is actually the one that you would want to use on, like, dirt tracks with swooping jumps. So I think we're going to try it here. I'm actually at the West Coast USA dirt track, and this is an area in this map that we barely ever used. If we've used it at all, I'm not really sure. All right, so we might try to spawn an AI here and see if they can maybe handle it. All right, let's try this out. Oh, 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 okay. Not too bad so far. Handling feels a little more predictable on this one. Uh, it doesn't feel as tail happy. Uh, let's get through that. There we go. Uh, these jumps are so awesome. Uh, let's go over this one. Am I going? Yeah, I am going the right way, I think. Uh, let's get it sideways. Uh, a little too sideways there. Hold on, just spin it around. Uh, up, 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 up. Don't even hit the wall there. All right, there should be a big jump. Where is it at? Is it coming up? There's a big jump where I think it goes over the track. I want to try to get over to that section. Oh, I think it's right here. Uh-oh, uh oh we're sideways. Oh, <laughs> oh, that was a brutal crash. Actually, it really only ripped the fender back. Not bad. All right, we'd still be uh, good to go here. That doesn't feel like there's any suspension or tire damage. All right, so we got ourselves a buddy here. We're going to attempt this with two vehicles. So if I go AI, are you going to want to go this way? I go to random. There he goes. All right, here we go. Let's do this together. All right. Man, could you imagine if we had big off-road races in BMG? Oh, you're slow. Come on, AI. Hit the gas, Grandpa. Uh, let's go for an inside. Oh, oh, he's going to cut me off. Dang it. Uh, and let's see if I can get around you somehow. Let's go. Oh, no one to go over there. All right. I need to find a way I can go wide open. Feels like you're putting behind traffic here. I think these things drive better the faster you go. Uh, here we go. We're going to go up the ends. Oh, I'm caught on his fender. No, I got his fender stuck in the tire. What the heck? Come on. I need you to <laughs> let me have that back, please. Oh, there we go. All right, we're good. Uh-oh. What is he? Are you going to do this in reverse now? Uh, okay. All right, here we go. Uh, there we go. Boom. Oh, uh, wait. Whose tire is that? Is that? Maybe it's one of the spares off that last one? I don't know. I'll get over this. Oh. Oh, there we go. Just rip the tire off. This is a really, really tight off-road course for this size of vehicle. It almost feels like this is a track for UTVs. Go. Boom. And over this section. Uh, let's go up through here. Yeah, I think we might attempt a small police escape. Uh, I'm going to switch back to the West Coast version of this. And we'll try that. And then we'll probably finish this off with uh, probably one of the big, ridiculous maps that have the huge jumps on it. That way, hopefully, we can ramp a couple more. Because I think this is where this uh, vehicle shines the best, is the ramping and the air you get with it. It's uh, absolutely incredible. Uh, going for the pass, going for the jump pass. 
Ooh, oh, no. Oh, we caught the catch fence. Oh, we caught the... Wait, we're good. We're good. Come on. There we go. Take out your competitor. Huh? Let's go reverse. And let's just gas it forward. There we go. All right. Looks like we are... Uh, we're going to go here. Where'd my little compadre go? Oh, there he is. What the heck? <laughs> he decided that he's going to go backwards now. Guess it's uh, one way to uh, take out your competitors. All right, let's get off this course. All right, so we're going to try one more police chase, and then I thought I was going to go to a ridiculous map, but I realized I can just spawn a ramp. And I think with the speed that some of these vehicles have, we could do some really crazy jumps. So let's go ahead and try this out one more time in a pursuit. Let's go chase me. All right, here we go. Oh, got to lot up those back tires real quick. Okay, there we go. All right, so we're in the gas fully now. I think we were outrunning those cops like crazy. Look at this. It's not even a competition. I have to be wide open here. All right, so what do we want to do here? Uh, I mean, I'm pretty much already... Uh-oh, uh-oh, on brakes, brakes, brakes. Uh, be careful going up the exit ramp. I can do something the cops... Wait, no, never mind. There's a fence there. I was going to hop off that and just go back on the other side of the highway. Are they any bit near me? What in the heck? We can't be that much... Oh, here they come. Wow, that took forever. Yeah, this thing, uh, it's gonna take a mighty cop car to keep up with it. Maybe we'll get a police version of this. Yeah, here they come up the... Oh, I think they just crashed each other. Yeah, one of the units in the back just crashed. And, all right, here comes this guy. Dude, I don't think you're... Wow, did the AI get dumber? <laughs> I don't know if they're just trying to keep up with the speeds and they're overdriving a lot of these corners. I don't remember the Beam and G AI being this bad. Like, they have not done good today. All right, so we're going to speed off through... Oh, this is going to be a barrel roll. Come on. Keep going. Land it. There we go. Yeah, there's not many vehicles that you can do that with in Beam and G. It's like, oh, you just barrel rolled. You know, it's completely fine. Drives uh, like new. All right, here we go. This is the stuff I want to start hitting. All right, try to get in the gas. Oop. Trying to get a little air. We've got to do this going downhill, too. All right, wide open now. And, oop. I think it's a little more abrupt on the side. There we go. All right, let's make a right right here, and we're going to go up the hill. And we're going to come back down and go around. All right, ready to go. Let's get moving. All right. Oop. Okay. We're good. And down this one. Oh, man. Down this one. Look how smooth it is on these jumps. Oh, it's cool. All right, hit the brakes real hard. Try to get her to rotate. Oh. <laughs> I almost want to set up one of those race courses like the, uh, I think it's the Robbie Gordon trophy trucks. or the, I think they're called the SST trucks, which I'm pretty sure they're quite a bit smaller than these. But they do a lot of street courses, and I think it would be really cool to do something like that in Beam and G. Have like a really pretty cool, tight street course. I need to learn to use the e-brake a bit more with this. See if I can get it to rotate a bit better on the streets. Does fine on the dirt, though. Have no issues there. Oop, 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 oop. Eh, it's going to be a curb. All right, let's go set up a ramp. All right, so we're just going to place one of these metal ramps over here. There's actually a new mod out that lets you create your own ramp kind of on the go. We probably should have grabbed that, but I think this will be okay. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to be able to hit this anyways. All right, so we're going to switch back to the red vehicle, the one we used in the car jump arena, and we're going to attempt to get some air off a ramp here. All right, red one is out. Let's go and do a little bit of a speed test real quick to see about how fast we can make these, uh, like, say, this turn here. We'll be coming at it a lot faster. I think this thing tops out right around 160, if I'm not mistaken. So we're good here, good here, good here. Uh, we'll probably have to start somewhere right around probably here. Oh, come on, come on. Oh, oh that was brutal. Oh, and she still runs. Huh? Can we hop this? Oh, no, come on. Come on. Will you climb it? I need to get on that side. You serious? Ouch. That look it hurt. <laughs> a lot. All right, like I was saying, I think we're going to start about right here. So let's go ahead and start picking up speed. All right, ease into it. All right, now I'm wide open now. I think we can take that slight curve. I think we can do it wide open, hopefully. Uh, that lead up to the ramp. This right here. The back end's going to want to step out here, but I think think we've got it come on come on come on there's the ramp Ooh, that ramp's kind of in a bad spot here we go oh yes uh-oh uh-oh oh 
Oh, man. I got so excited. I clicked down on the remote. <laughs> oh, I was clinched there. I didn't know if we were going to make it or not. Did we damage the ramp? Oh, uh, we need to run that again. All right, we got a bit more uh, run up this time. Let's see if we can get a little bit more speed here. All right, looking good. Oh, yes. Feel that power. It's so satisfying once this thing finally hooks up with the back tires so you can be wide open. All right. Here we go. Be on the lookout for the ramp. It's in a little different position. Oh, dropped the tire there. Uh, I don't think we scrubbed off too much speed. All right. Looking for the ramp. Look for the ramp. There it is. It's going to look like it's a little bit better angle this time. Oh, there we go. Oh, we tipped the light pole. Hold on. Land it. Land it. Land it. Land it. Land it. Uh-oh. Oh. <laughs> Our landing zone is a parking lot that I don't think can really take this thing. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, let's move the ramp up a little bit. All right, can confirm. The ramp is a little further back now. We've got good speed through here. Uh-oh, uh uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, we're good, we're good. All right, there it is. Oh, oh we hit it a little sideways that time. Parking garage. Uh-oh, oh, oh, oh. Oh, there you go. That's the, uh, well, that's about the damage model you got. Oh, we actually, oh, we would have killed the co-driver. The cage crushed in on that side. Well, let's hope nobody was riding with us. This is an absolutely awesome mod. I'm going to link it down in the description. Hopefully you guys go check it out. Uh, if you guys have any suggestions with this mod, let me know down in the comment section below. Uh, we could try several things. Maybe some of the downhill races would work with this. Police chases, this thing seems to outrun most police cars at the moment. I mean, we could do an off-road versus off-road, but you guys kind of saw how the AI was able to control this thing, which, yeah, that was uh, pretty non-existent. So, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, thank you guys for all the love and support on the BMNG series. Uh, we're going to hit this one. Oh, no, it's sideways. Uh-oh. Uh, uh, oh. <laughs> yep, well, that was, uh, yep, we destroyed the ramp. There goes the fun. Uh, Komodo ruined it. But yeah, thank you guys for all the love and support. We'll return with some more police chases soon, and we will see you guys next time in Beam and G Drive.